external housing that snaps on your uh, your existing controller. Okay. So we're gonna snap the, the housing on. Now what the Avenger is meant to do is give you a lot more actions per second when you use the event when you use it. So your fingers are gonna go through these hoops. So here you zoom okay. and your trigger. Your fingers stay on the uh, the bumpers. Now I have my reload here, my switch weapons here, and my crouch button here. So ordinarily, without this on, you need to move your thumbs off of the analog. Right? right. So I'm able to run, dive, shoot, coming around the corner without moving my fingers off the analog. If I'm playing you one-on-one -on -one in a game, there's no way you're beating me. You run out of ammo, you got to go here, I'm there already. You need to switch weapons, you're over here, I'm already there in a split second. You know Let's try I mean? it out. Huh? Let's try it out. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, and I'm playing. I mean, I'm playing. Um, I'm playing uh, L.A. Noir right now with it. So I mean, you can literally play any game with it. I mean, a button, ma a button mashing game such as Mortal Kombat. Imagine having all those buttons right at your fingertips. X, Y, Z, A. You know, without having to move your fingers off the analogs or the D-pad. So I'd say the learning curve is different for everybody, um, you know. But for the most part, good solid 45 minutes with it, you're good to go. You know, um, my nephew picked it up in 20 minutes. I'm getting the hang of some of them. I'm having trouble with the B. The B is just a rock, though. All you need to do is just rock it a little bit. And, and the more you play, the, the, the more familiar you're gonna get with the B. And it's positioned perfectly right now. So you're using your finger for the trigger only because it's you know, just yeah. that's the way you use the plan. Yeah. Four fingers in. You can do that, but now you can, now you don't get access to your needs. You know what I mean? How long has this been on the market? CES in um, January, so we went January at CES, PAX Boston. Um, now we're AE three here. So good. Uh, what what other month we're in? January, February, March, April, May, June. $49.99 retail. You can pick up on uh, Amazon.com, on eBay, um, on our website, AvengerController.com. What other products does N-Control have out right now? Um, we have the PS3 version in development, which is right over here okay. on the G4 board. Um, we were just reviewed by G4. We were on X-Play, which Adam Sussel gave us an excellent review. When do you expect the uh, PS3 controller to be out? Um, we're shooting for anywhere from three to six months. Um, it's just in manufacturing right now, so... Is it's it about pretty much ready it. to go? Um, well, we need, we need to get it tweaked out in order to where it needs to be um, because the Xbox control is shaped a little bit differently, but we're almost there. Well, it's neat. Thanks for talking to us. Thank you very much for stopping by. I appreciate Thanks. it. Thanks. You can close up the controller. You keep playing with it. What? Can you talk to the controller real quick? Yeah. So, putting our fingers here in the triggers, and instead of pulling the trigger, I just do a little tap like this. For your Y button, it's just a tap like that, instead of taking my thumb off the joystick and doing that, which the controller allows you to do. So if you still want to hit your Y button, you do that. But this allows me just to keep my thumb on the trigger and change weapons while I'm still moving around. Uh, same thing for crouch. B, just kind of tap it like that, and then we've got reload. Instead of taking my thumb off the trigger to do that, I just flick it. So it's pretty neat. It's just a little attachment that comes off just like that. It's the Avenger controller by N Control, and he says it's $49.99. Available now through Amazon. PS3 on the way.